is your relationship real with Jamal or is it true that he has, as your father said, just recently had another baby with another woman while he was dating you. He said six or seven babies, mamas, and the seventh baby allegedly is the new baby. Is that true? And if that is true, it happened on your watch while you brought him to the show. I want to know. That's all. Because I don't want anything to do with this mess. But I, people are telling well, me. Well, since you don't want to have anything to do with it. Yes. Great. Auntie, do you have any questions? Would you stay with him if he had a baby with another woman? He, he has not. My father was exaggerating, um, of course. I mean, Jamal and I have been through a lot. You know, there's a lot that people say. And we, we're... But we when y'all were announcing it. that y'all got back together, he told his girlfriend at the time that it was just reality TV and it wasn't true. Thanks. How do you know that? How do I you know, know because the lady who he's been dating for years She's only waiting to fall in a relationship for a while. She's a pastor and she reached out to me a long time ago. She sent a bunch of screenshots, Ooh. pictures of him in her bed and everything else. And I was like, yeah, I'm not going there. I don't play dirty. But Sounds like since Giselle likes to play Sounds dirty, like rumors, right? I'll go ahead and return since I'm here right now. But he's definitely been talking to another woman, and it's clear conversations. And if you'd like to see him, I got him in my little receipt book right here. I don't have any reaction to that. Well, then you can just go ahead and have this. He's always asking about her schedule. He's sending screenshots to her whenever he's doing his little church tours. How do you and, know uh, those texts are real? You want me to call out his phone number? I'm sure she knows what his phone number is. What's your motivation behind that? 410. Mom Bryant. Is that his phone number? Yeah, that's his phone number. Okay. Does that upset you if that's his phone number she just said? I don't believe anything that comes out of Monique's mouth or anything that she has in her binder. I'm glad she's done some bindering. I knew she was coming to She said, for me, it's not whatever. a good idea to travel to Atlanta if you're working on putting your family back together again. He says, what are you talking about? She says, what am, what am I talking about? And she screenshots the actual article. I'm really listening to this. This is the same Jamal person Bryant who tried to run the drivers to Bravo because somebody was rumors. spreading true about her what family. What are you talking about? Can we not? It's Can we not, not real? It's real. No, it's not. TV. It's disgusting. Did you want to see? It's disgusting. Well, this is my reasoning friend. for bringing this, this to friend. light. Well, if you want to come from disgusting. my family and my relationship, I'm coming right back to you. Did you bring a full binder that you read verbatim what a hoe might have said about the, the pastor? That's it's pathetic. No. Of course, I'm going to bring my receipts to back up everything that I'm saying. So while you sitting over here having fake fraudulent relationships with your, your ex, your kids ain't even happy about it. You sitting up here sitting like a darn fraud, bringing a different man onto the reunion every freaking year. I hope he's sitting behind you this year. That's the holy whore. Ooh. Since you want to keep calling my husband big boy. Is Jamal coming? No, he's of course not. not. <laughs> wow. Your boyfriend is slinging his big D all around his congregation, even in Atlanta as we speak. And you know it. You know it. You're a fraud. Any reaction to this? Of course she doesn't have reaction because she knows it's true.